Hello, welcome back. Knight here. This is episode 34 of my Athens campaign, Rome 2. I think we're up to turn about 116, I think. Uh, I'll just quickly show you the strategic map. There we go. Um, obviously, I am the the diplomatic stage that always makes more sense so I'm the yellow uh, I've got an army here to guard against the Bastani who have quite a few territories that don't particularly like me got another army here in the Gatai territory that we took um, got an army here that's being I think I'm gonna make another army up here actually to be honest between Ephesus and Athens if I remember rightly I've got garrisons um, sorry barracks in both those cities um, all the action is in the east at the moment. I'm about to ta attack a Hellenic rebel territory here. Well, I'll probably actually just starve them out, to be honest, rather than take losses. Um, we're moving north to attack Aria. Tisagatai, the blue, um, are our allies. They're taking quite a few hits at the moment, so we may be able to move into there. If uh, Aria takes their territories, we'll nip in quick and take them. Um, Actually, I've only got four armies there. I'd probably need, in fact, only three and a half because this isn't a full stack. So I need to increase troops there. And once we've taken out the Aria, we're going to attack Dragania. They're allied to Persia, Media, Sagatia, Saba. Basically, all these territories up to here, basically, will then be at war with me. Uh, Seleucid is already at war with um, Media and so Egypt. Right, I don't know how much medium I actually own most of Egypt to be in, Ethiopia and Egyptus. Anyway, and that's the situation. I'm going to go straight, whilst I think of it, I need to do something over in the east. I, I don't feel I've got enough troops. Those who have been watching will see that I've actually fortified the unit, which I never do that. I don't think, I've, this is the first time in the whole series that I've ever fortified a unit. Normally I'm pushing ahead. I never normally wait for anything. Not strategically anyway. I always um. Yeah, I need to make these up into a full stack. So can I recruit? I think I can now, actually. Let's have a look. Yeah, I'll be out. I've got no bunny at the moment. I'll be able to walk some Theros, Theros spears, which are quite good, actually. Look at those. And some stingers. So I'll spam up a, an army here. Um... Right, I'm just going to quickly check my public order, because again, that's a bit dodgy. Armenia, Pontocaspia, yeah, and these two territories here, okay. Let's start at Hellas. I think that's actually okay, to be honest. I don't think there's any problem there. I don't know why it's saying that there's a problem in Hellas. There isn't really, as far as I can see. Pontocaspia, I think we've actually got rebels up here from what I remember. Yes, yes, so, but I've got an army here that's going to come down and kill them. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think it's Cilicia, 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 Cilicia. Okay, plus four, so that's fine. Public order stable, so we should be okay then now. There's that army waiting to attack the Hellenic rebels. Um, I think Armenia was dodgy as well, wasn't it, it was saying. Uh, where's Armenia? Armenia. That's plus three as well. Change public order stable. Okay, so that's not a problem. It's really these two over here then. I need to... Actually, perhaps I need to do bread, bread and games in both these cities, I think. Oh, I don't own the whole of that, so I can't do anything there. But I do here, so I could actually do a provincial edict here, bread and games, which may help things along. Now what I've got to do is try and find where I'm currently doing bread and games. I think I've said before, I can't believe that there isn't a quicker way to find out where you're doing bread and games. We're going to cancel that edict. In theory, I would have thought that's affected my money. Public order will go up. Taxes are seven at the moment. Right, so we're going to move back here. I think I'm going to um, get some... I'm going to do four by four. 
that's actually doing one, isn't it? That's doing an edict. That was Harmazoa, although Harmazoa is actually all right, saying that. Military presence, nine. So we're not going to get a... I'm going to have to keep an army down there. It's here, actually. I want to do an edict. Right, that's weird. I thought I'd revoked in Armenia. Let's have a look. Right, now perhaps I can do it. I didn't hear the boom. You heard the boom that time, didn't you? Right, okay, let's try over here. Now we can. Let's do bread and games. Still terrible, isn't it? Public halls are shocking. <laughs> Is that because it's Eastern? Yeah, so something's making it all Eastern. Should, in theory, once these temples come online. Right, anyway, let's, um, I'm sure at the end turn now, uh, I uh, don't think there's anything else I want to do. Mind you, I might be wanting to move my agents. I can't remember if I moved them. This yeah, she can still move, I think. I want to try and see what's happening down here. I think I did notice that the Raytai were actually doing very well against the um, Genoa. Genoa. Taking Ariminium. I think they're even taking Brindisium from the... Yeah, they're doing very well, actually. Well, hopefully the Spartans can hold them long enough for me to finish in the east, or at least finish out Saudi Arabia. Peninsula, and then we'll move on to attack them. Crisis, we've moved nearer. Can we move them? I think we probably can actually. I need to get some more information. I need to know what's going on in Egypt, I think. What media owns and what they don't own, basically. Um, let's spy over here. What do we want them to do? Oh, that's it. We can't do anything with them. Right, let's end the turn. Next turn, I'm going to concentrate on starting to produce the army in Ephesus and Athens. Oh, good. The old Spartans are fighting back. That's good, because that was a bit of a worry there for a moment. They need to take back Brindisium, I think. That should be their next target. And, sorry, the other thing I was going to do is, apart from building an army up, I'm going to... Um, and that army will be used against the north coast of Africa. Um, against the media when we attack in in Saudi Arabia, that will force us into war with media, I'm sure. Um, we'll also need to look at public order in those two areas in the east because I want to move the armies up. There's no point in us having whole armies garrison in. I'm going to need those to attack the Aria because they look a bit kind of resurgent to be honest. Whoop! Looks like the Bastana are doing us a favour. That was weird. They took to sea there. So weird. They trespassed and then to see. How odd. Dragania is looking a bit um, iffy. Oh dear, Sousa's about to fall unfortunately, I think, looking at that. That's the third territory of the um, Gaul, Persephilus, Sousa. That's the third province, third region of that province. So it looks as if um, Seleucids might get that. Okay, Sabah, Sagatia. Okay, slaves are still around. I thought they were destroyed, actually. Anyway. Right, someone's died, obviously. Um, oligarchs, I'm the oligarchs, aren't I? I think... Gosh, they're all oligarchs, that's weird. Let's see who's the best. It doesn't tell me where Odysseus Wonders are. I can't remember, to be honest. Because this guy would be your guy. Your Paeus Lancers. Rebellion Articola, we knew that. And in Capisan, we knew that. 
Oh, that's the guy who dies. Right, okay. What's here? Not much, actually, not much. And not much there, really. Ooh. They're kind of like... Betwixt and between, aren't they? They're not really garrisoning it either. Tisagatai. I really need the Tisagatai to attack them. Do the business for us. Anyway, let's sort out these rebellions first. See where they've spammed. Oh, that's handy. He's right next to me. So we're going to take them out immediately. And then we'll do some recruiting. I'm just going to quickly... 87%. Can't really argue with that. Do we lose our general? Not that matters. Kill them. Right, let's move back into the city if we can. Not quite. Oh, we can. Right, let's recruit. Get some spearmen. Um, what's public order like here now? Minus six. That's a lot better. Plus four public order. Five turns, actually. It's not fantastic, is it? Right, well, we're going to go for that anyway. Um, that's coming into... That's plus eight public order, so that'll be brilliant with that. And that's plus five. Um, we still, I don't really feel we're still getting very much money, to be honest. Um, we're going to go for a grain market, get some money. Wow, that's all my money gone, so I can't do anything with that yet. Right, he's recruiting. We're going to get another rebellion here soon. Um, can I raise a dignitary? So he can spread stuff. Uh, um, um, I don't really know which one to, to go for. This guy, this guy looks the business, to be honest. I'm not being sexist here. I think he looks like he's the business. Right. Oh, someone's, someone's ranked up straight away. Was that? That's really work. That's really weird. Um. We'll go for that one. Right, we need to sort out our science. So it's either that for a military port or that for raw barracks. So I think raw barracks is more important at the moment. We will need um, a there's some guys there. We're going to recruit another dignitary if we can. Okay. Uh, this, the, this is the girl. This is the lady we want. Okay, minus eight. We've got lots of temples being built there. Not that we can do very much else. We've got almost no money left now. So we need to take this guy out of to normal stance. Can we get this guy? We can. Where's he going? Oh. That was weird. I think we attacked across the river. We go, he's gone. 98, 97, 98. Okay, hopefully, we'll rank up as well. No, he didn't, that's a shame. Oh, he did, that's excellent. That's. Oh, my word. Um. Five percent morale. Scars. He's not much authority, has he? So we go for authority-based stuff. Um, I think what we're going to do. Don't really want to stick them. 
in a city. Uh, Merv is a good idea because I mean, at least we kind of knew, knew near to Maracanda. Um, five turns before we get a rebellion, but we're going to have all these things online fairly soon. So I'm going to put him into Force March. We're going to try and move up to Merv if we can, or move towards Merv. Hopefully we'll be able to attack Bukhara and Marakanda soon. We'll bring that army up. That's public orders in control. Bactria is actually plus seven at the moment. A lot of that's military present, which is nine. Three turns for that. <clears throat> Two for that. So maybe a couple of turns before we can do anything there. I'm not going to have any enough money to um, start recruiting my army in in Hellas. Um, no, I can't do anything there. Uh, so I really need the some action between Tisagatai and the Arya, to be honest. I can't believe they're going to get any stronger. They've only got three three territories now. Kath, Bukhara and Marakanda. I don't think they've taken anything else. Have they up here? Let's have a look. Aktau. No, these are really separated out. Sara, there's like only three territories up there. Kath would be nice to have, actually. And Amur. That'd be my ideal situation. I could take this province and that province. That would be perfect. I wouldn't bother to take any more. Um, at the moment, Amul would be the problem. Hopefully, the Aryan will help us out if they take it out. So we've got three armies here. Doing bread and games in this territory. Let's um, have a quick look at Disorder. So we've got Disorder over here. Here we know about it. We're going to send our general round to attack. This is green now. Perseus. We need to look at Perseus. Let's look down here. Once we've done this, we'll be moving on to attack more. Perseus. So we've got, got stuff coming online pretty soon. And it's not far off now anyway, it's plus six. So military presence is ten, but we should be again that'll be fine soon, that'll release this army. Um so it's a shame that Seleucids have grabbed Sousa. We're not in any position yet to attack media. We need to have the Aria gone first before we can attack Dragania. And that's what we'll do. We'll focus on Dragania and then we'll hold here on this coast. We'll take Dragania, hold on this coast. It looks like Seleucids have actually formed a, a kind of barrier between my enemies and myself at the moment, which will be handy. So I can then bring armies down from Dragania across to attack around here, Saudi Arabia, and then, oh, Egypt, look at that. Okay, so we've got some more information now. Media own these. This is my way, Murray. Attacks across the coast here, which would just be tie down a lot of armies and cause me problems. So I want to, before I attack Dragania, or when I attack Dragania, I want to be a position that I, could, that I can knock out these cities immediately. So I need at least like three, maybe four armies. Uh, right, this army here. Enough talk. We'll go back to fighting some battles. See if we can get Palmyra. It's got 20 now, so we need to. Put that into new normal stance. Is it a walled city? It's not, is it? Oof. Uh, I think what we'll do... Do I three in circle or not? Are the odds going to get better? Let's just see. Oof. 48%. These are bad. These are bad odds. So I'll either fight it or in circle. So I think I'm going to encircle for the moment. I'm going to suffer attrition. Um, yeah, but that's what we'll do. What are we doing over here? Right. It's, it's actual public order is very good here, actually. So when I build my... It's going to cause 10 public order when I build my royal barracks. And we're getting... Why won't it let me do this? Look at there. Oh, it's just so powerful. Just such, so glitchy this interface. We're getting 27, so minus 10 will be 17. Military presence is 9, so that'll be plus 1. Yeah, that's fine. Take him out of false march, actually. 
to where he is, he needs to be. Um, I've got a champion point to move in. Military training. And here we're going to try and take out the... I don't think we can quite reach, to be honest. Let's have a look. It'd be a pain if we can't. Oh, we can. There we go. 91, that's not good. Okay. We shouldn't lose any units, we'll just, yeah, that's fine. Right, so we need to <coughs> increase, excuse me, we need to increase their... Admiral... Strategist... Cunning... Let's go for Cunning. Force details. Can we get night fighting? Night fighting is so brilliant, to be honest. Defences. We actually haven't had these defences yet, have we? I'm going to go for that one. Um, right, that's a slight worry that the Bustan I have now gone into the... Um, the Black Sea, which is a bit of a way, they've trespassed across my territory because that's actually all owned by me now, the Black Sea, every single... Yeah, okay. Right, all the ports in the Black Sea are mine. Right, uh, just one more check of... We know what's happening down here. Okay, I'm going to end my turn again. I don't think there's anything else I want to do. Spies are getting lots of information now about what's surrounding me. I might try and get a, an alliance with Egypt, actually. Or see if they'll, they'll become a client state or something. Come on, Spartans. Do your job. Hold off the UA tie. Ah, this is the thing. Hopefully they'll turn around and attack them all. Any luck? Oh, he's up to no good. Ah, I didn't even know they could go around that way, to be honest. That's interesting. But he has kind of left his territory a bit unguarded. really got to start preparing for a surprise attack by media because I'm sure that they're they must realize that the writing's on the wall if they don't attack me the hatred of me must be building up as well amongst that alliance okay um, wow all that Palmyra, concealed agent. Ah, they've taken Bukhara. Damn. Damn them. So we should try and take Marakanda, basically. Or we'll wait for them to counterattack, actually. So I think that Bukhara will fall. Looking at that, although it's got a fantastic number of um, step horse archers. Right, okay, he moved an army round here as well, didn't he? Bugger. A big army, actually. A big ass army. Okay, can this guy move? Can we take out of put him into normal stance? Let's move him into Eurocratia. Tidia. So we're absolutely fine here. There's no problem. We've even got public order under control now by doing that. Um, so we'll kind of hold off. We've got an army. 
Is Merv okay? It's actually plus one now. Plus one, so literal crackdown is seven, so we still need to improve public order. And we're even having bread and games, it's still not enough. So we've got Grove. Sacred Grove. Grove of Nymphs. Actually we don't need all that. That is four. That is eight. That is ten when we get that. So in fact I think we need to go for Grove of Nymphs, which is eight. Eighteen. That'll turn things around, I think. So I haven't got an army actually in the cities at the moment. So we're gonna we're gonna move up actually with this army. We really want to take advantage of the situation if we can. So we're gonna come up to here. So we stand by and watch Amul go. Um, so we kind of got him boxed in. We're actually fortifying. Well, not fortified in three of the cities around him. Um, this army, how's that doing? That's plus one as well, which is not too bad. Actually, that's not bad at all. Um, we've got a dignitary here now, haven't we? Or his effects. Plus four cultural conversion. Okay, so that's fine. That's good. Right, so so it's gradually turning that round, basically. That's what we're trying to do. Um, it's only 71%, so we're getting this under control as well with this dignitary. Up here. We'll keep her in the territory. So I think, if we look now, things should be a lot better. It was still shown as being poorly. Um, Armenia, that's a bit of a shock. It keeps coming up with Armenia, but I think it's actually okay. I'm just going to check it again, just to make sure. Minus one, 20 turns. So we need to do something here. Um, can't build anything more there. Grain market... 12 food. Got plenty of food at the moment. We need crane mechanics to improve that. And we need temple design to do that. Right, so it's 4. And it needs 7. For the next... Uh, how long is that? 20 turns. I think we can afford to sit by and let that fester for a while. I don't think we're going to have a attack anytime soon. I'm going to move back into... Albia. Well, actually, we're going to move just outside so we can get the benefit of the, the garrison in Albia, which is not that bad. Um, it's only plus two at the moment. Military crackdown, we need to... We really need to increase the effect of public order. Hellenic influence. It's already 100% Hellenic, so we're not worried about that. 60 worth from culture. 10% worth well, security against sorry, right, mob. It's only two though, isn't it? That's an army one related. That's a knowledge based one. Well, knowledge is always good, isn't it? Can I get three? None of them are four. So we'll go for three public order. What can we do here? That's 50 wealth. We'll go for that as well. And woof. That is a lot of money. We've got to turn these cities over into... Well, they actually are the right type, but we're not getting a lot of money, are we, from them? So, I mean, money's quite low, so I need to... Well, I want to build that army, don't I? That's the trouble. I can't do everything. Let's carry on building that army up. Because we're getting a fair amount of money. That's not a problem, is it, at the moment? Money. We're going to carry on recruiting here. And we're going to start recruiting over here. I think Ephesus and... Yeah. 
so we can do some business here. Right, let's recruit, let's raise some forces. We can raise another two generals. Two more public order. I think this is the guy. So we'll reinstate legacy, see if there's anyone we can his claws are a good army. Let's reinstate. Recruit that. And then we're going to put very good troops here, actually. I begin to like the old Thorax Swordsman, to be honest. Quite like those. Um, here. Let's raise forces. I think this was the guy, wasn't it? They're both oligarchs. So I've no... Again, let's reinstate some legacy. Might of Heracles, let's reinstate. And recruit. Can't recruit anything at the moment. Militia hoplites are rubbish, so I don't really want to recruit them. Okay, I do have some actually. That's a militia hoplite, I think, I believe. Um, right, okay. Don't think there's anything else I need to do at the moment. Um, it looks as if Sparta is fighting back. They need to take out Brundisium if they can. Because it's fairly close to my home territories. I don't really want a problem there. Um, sorry, we're not going to do anything. We're going to continue to besiege over here in Palmyra if I can find it. Where are we? It's down here, isn't it? There we go. We're going to continue to besiege. We're both suffering um, attrition, but how many turns has he got to go? He's only got one turn to go, actually, so he's got to come out and attack Minisco or suffer the consequences. They're all silver, actually, these. They're quite good troops if he comes out and fights me. That's going to be a hard battle. Unfortunately, Sousa has fallen to the Seleucids. I say unfortunately, because I was after that territory. It looks as like if they've taken Charax as well. Um, they're on their way, aren't they? The Seleucids, they're doing well. Dragania. Yeah, it might be the Seleucids are going to clear this out for us. I don't know. Persia. Now, if you look at the political map again. Diplomatic status. I can't do it from the Seleucids point of view, but they're actually at war with all these countries. Yeah, the whole lot. Media. All of them. Oh, I was going to... See if Egypt would sit still for something, wasn't I? I will listen with all respect to the words you speak and give divine pharaohs fair. No. Then they won't go for that. Won't go for that. Um. Nope. So we're not really getting very far with the Egyptians. They don't really like us. Okay. Fair enough. Um, yeah, Seleucids are really resurgent. At one stage, that looked like they were going to be beaten. Okay, so we're positioning ourselves well over here to take advantage of anything that happens with them. Um, the Aria should, if this guy comes down, I think we can probably take him. Actually, don't think we can attack him in the hills. No, we don't have enough. What's the um, garrison like in Ekratia? Militia hoplites, four mob, I'm not really bothered about that. That's just terrible, that, that garrison. So I'm not going to move out of the city, we'll stay in the city. Gosh, got a lot of Tarotine cavalry. What has he got? He's got a lot of uh, mercenary light horse or skirmishers. That would be a hard battle, actually. He's got a nicely balanced army. I'm sure that they have improved the eye. It's not just spamming out all um, slingers or all really cheap troops. It's actually, I'm finding it more difficult to actually beat it, to be honest. Um, so things are, the game does seem to be improving like with each of these. Right, okay, I think I'm going to end my turn now. There's nothing more I can do. Oh, unassigned skill. I have worked out there's a quick way of doing this now. You can just get to that. There we go. Unassigned skill. There we go. Yes, quick way of doing it, you see. Makes you dizzy, but um, it's the guy knows that. This guy. 
Okay, so what has he got? Not much. He's not much of a hero, is he? I think we'll go for cunning, actually. Yeah. Okay, now we try. Yeah, there we go. This public order is kind of under control. I might be able to move that army out of Capucine fairly soon. I'll probably move it north to um, support the other three armies. That should be enough to take out the Aria then. The ah, they're on a peace treaty. Long enough, and now, at your I don't think they've lost that the as well. They've lost Bukhara. Be no, I don't think so. I'm not going to give you a peace treaty. I need you dead, basically, so I could never trust them not to attack me. If, and I can't afford to keep armies garrison there, that's a waste of time. Maybe they'll come back and attack the... Um, try and take Bukhara again. Well, mind you, they've moved out of Makara Maka Marakanda. I keep wanting to say Macarena. Oh, Macarena. Um, right. Things are going well for the Athenian alliance with the Seleucids. They're doing very well actually, the Seleucids. Hmm. It's a bit of a worry. Me just sailing all around my islands. I think we need to keep spamming out that army as quickly as possible, Ephesus and um, Athens. I've raised two generals, I will get rid of one of them once I've amalgamated them. The army from Athens will be coming across to Ephesus to protect Asia Minor. Oh, another noble death. Um, wow, I think he's the guy. Origin Origenes. Okay. Right. Uh, captured. Let's occupy. Ready for battle. I was certainly say that's a fault at the moment. That it doesn't. The um, AI doesn't tend to actually. Doesn't tend to actually attack. I found that on a couple of times. It's actually quite easy to get hold of territories. Right. Okay. And then stick town glassware. Got 300, that's good. The rest is all, it should be happy actually looking at this, it's minus 19, but for 25 of that is this turn only. Do we get a sacred grove? I don't think we need to, to be honest. In fact, it might be worth getting a sacred grove. And then moving out, mate. That's what the best thing to do, I think. Can I recruit? Only slingers. We've got quite a lot of slingers, but um, right. Let's have a think what we're going to do over here. Let's recruit some more troops. Commander. So I like these thorax swordsmen. Pikeman, poplight, javelin men, slingers, Tarantine cavalry, citizen cavalry. Um, I really need a royal barracks to try and get some decent cavalry, to be honest. These will do. These will do at the moment. Oh, I didn't realise that. I can group four there. Yeah? Right. Okay. That's nice. Over here. He's going to recruit. Um, what have we got over here? Let's check again. We've got nine now, haven't we? I think coming up. Eight. Eight guys. So we need probably some more. Yeah. So that's four. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight hoplites, that's fine. So it's cavalry and yeah, okay, that's fine. I know what I'm getting cavalry and slingers next. Okay, Pulpadiva, Pulpadiva. Hmm. 
I'm wondering about getting rid of this actually. I've basically got three territories that are producing troops. It's Ephesus, um, Athenae, and this one right the way over here. Which reminds me, I want to produce some more troops here, don't I? So we've got a full stack. Um, got some slingers. Some thorough spears. One, two, three. I can't get any cavalry here, can I? Oh well. Four, five. Okay, let's try some slingers. Okay. That's it, 19, and we'll maybe try and get a champion or something. Okay, so we're fine here. He's now fortified. Well, that's not going to do him much use, is it? Um, I think we can probably move forwards, to be honest. It's going to, be, it's going to be tight, actually. I think he can... I don't know. Can he take that back? I think the thing is, I really need this army to move out. This army here, I really need to move them north. Um, if we move out and move up to here, move up to the edge, so we can still recruit. Move to here. Commander. Oh, minus six, that's not good. Your next Can we recruit still? Yes. Excellent. It's a good okay, life. that's fine. Right, so we're going to look at public order here. Belly in three turns. Grain market. Ooh. Three turns before we get. Public order of plus four. Can't build the nymph nymphion at the moment. Not sure I can afford to move that guy out. That's a pain, actually. If I have two. It's plus six at the moment in here. Public order stable. Um, what if I do that? If we move across the border, just across the border, and we'll see. It's public order like there now. It's going to be rolling in three turns. That's still plus six. So are they doing anything for public order? I don't know. Well, we'll see. Noble woman, that's a dignitary, isn't it? That's a dignitary. I thought dignitaries did good stuff. Public order. Cultural conversion. That's maybe just um cultural side this guy's doing, and what's this one doing? What do you wish of me? She's not so good actually, she's just doing a little bit of cultural conversion. Okay, well, it's better than nothing. Right, I think again we're at the end turn, but I've got to decide what I'm gonna do with that army in Palmyra actually. Let's have a look at Public order is the main thing that's bothering me at the moment. That'll flip over. Now, why on earth is Cecilia? Cilicia still got problems. I can understand those two, and even that one. Perseus, that's 15. That's going up hugely, actually. That's 14, so that's fine. Right, um, that's 6. Public order stable. It's really here, isn't it? That's the problem. Am I doing? I'm doing bread and games. That's still not having a good effect, is it? Hmm. It's a pain. Three turns. So I don't think I'm going to be able to move that army out. To be honest. Ready for orders. Right. Okay. Well, I think we're kind of finished. I'm, I'm going to hold off. I'm still not going to move in. I'm going to sit here. Support the um, my guys. Hopefully they'll lose Bukhara, but they'll take a lot of losses. Maybe they'll go for Makaranda. Who knows? Uh, right, I'm gonna end the turn. I've got plenty of food, plenty of money coming in. No, I'm not. I'm gonna quickly check my spies. My skills are yours. They're not really doing very much at the moment, are they? So you know what's happening over here. 
He's got nothing there, basically, at the moment. Well, I say nothing, he's got... He's got an Admiral. Ooh, he's got nothing in there. Ooh, that's tempting. Do I need to move the armies down from fighting Arya to do this? For a knockout blow, we really want it over in one turn. We're going to have to take out Sagacia as well. Chrysie, let's see where Chrysie is. What's she up to? Okay, so that's coming down to Towards oh, Korea. That's Riai Tai. I'm going to go across this way. Try and do some more. Come down here and try and find out some more information. Nihira. What's she doing? She's going towards over down to here. You can see some info. Oof. Media, we've already had a bit of a shock there. Over here, can't really use him to do anything. We're, we're really in a good position to see what there is on these three cities now. Still got a good garrison in Amul, which is our friend. That's rubbish, actually, that garrison. Um, over here. Okay, that's a good garrison in there. Right, I think it's just really deciding what we're going to do with this army. Down here. Um, I believe that Jerusalem and Petra will hold off the media guy, so I probably need to move this army back, to be honest. loses why don't they just take that city they could quite easily um, I find it easier to look at the strategic map to be honest um, right so the only one two three four Draganias take that back that's interesting so now will be a time to attack them if I had the troops but I don't um, Yeah, I've got a f I'm fine. I don't have any problems about this area. Them attacking into my homeland. It's really these three, so I need to move this army back towards um, Athens. I think. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. I think I can move it straight away. I think. Let's stick him into. All right. So we're going to move back gently to begin with. Terrible public order, but 39, three turns, most of that is the conquest, 25 will go, hmm. perhaps I'll leave him there for a turn, then we'll reassess, right, just going to end the turn, don't think there's anything else I want to do, nope, unassigned skill, oh, I'll have to come back to that, won't I? I'll end the episode after this um, this turn, then we'll see what's happening in um, Aria. That's the crucial. I don't really like sitting around waiting because it's it's all time, and I really need to move on to Dragania if I can. But equally, I don't want to lose a lot of troops. I've got a feeling I could probably if um, oh good, he's moving back, which is good. So we might be able to take out Kath now with a bit of luck. Hmm, it's media. Persia. We've got very big garrisons in Ephesus and, um, ah, oh, that's interesting. It's 
investigations have moved towards Sousa. Right, okay, so I assume Libya has lost its... Oh god, does that mean that that city suffered some damage? Where are we? Some heroes mercilessly done something to it. Not see anything to be honest. Was it there? I'm sure it was this guy, wasn't it? Mr. Dakkurt, enemy veteran. I can't see that it's actually done anything, to be honest. Anyway, right, I'm going to end the episode there. Um, looking at this, I think... Yeah, I'm pretty certain that Disagatai will lose Bukhara next turn. I think that we are going to head north, to be honest. Try and take out these guys. Well, it says they've got 20 now, which is a bit of a worry. Yeah, I've, I have a feeling they'll lose Bukhara, in which case we can probably move forwards with these guys. And they turn off to that, take advantage. Right, I'm going to end the episode there. I hope you've enjoyed it. There's normally plenty of um, action. We haven't actually fought a battle this time, but there's been plenty of movement on the strategic map, campaign map. Um, keep well, and I'll be speaking to you soon. Bye for now.